everyone, Be Your Mom here. I hope you're having an awesome week and are getting ready for the holidays coming up. Today I wanted to pop on really quick and share with you the latest print from Jujubee. This print here is called Rainbow Dreams and it is launching on the 5th of December. So it's not out yet, but it's perfect timing for Christmas. It is the latest collaboration between Jujubee, Tokidoki, and Sanrio. So all of your favorite characters that you know and you love with these super bright, vibrant colors. It's so adorable. I love, love, loving this print. I want to show you a couple of different bag styles that I have. I also have a couple of accessory pieces. I know a lot of you are always anxious to see these prints on accessories. And then at the very end, I want to show you a couple of my favorite Jujubee kind of classic prints that pair really well with this bag. So I'm going to go ahead and get started and show you this first bag. This is the Beast Sporty. I have it all packed up here. I carried it this past weekend. I love the Beast Sporty. It's really comfortable. There's a lot of different ways that you can carry the bag. You have this awesome grab handle here at the top. And then on the very back of the bag, you have these um, seatbelt straps that are removable. So you have the option to wear it backpack style here, which is how I prefer the wear, to wear the Sporty. I think it's really comfortable. I think it's a cute backpack. Um, so I usually wear it that way. But if you didn't want to wear it backpack style, the bag does come with an optional messenger strap and it has a memory foam piece here so it doesn't slip off your shoulder and it's really comfortable and it's adjustable. So if you wanna wear the bag crossbody, if you wanna just wear it long over your, over your shoulder, you have that way um, that you can do the sporty. So that is that strap. I did want to show you um, the lining on this sporty. This print is so cute. It is lined throughout with this adorable rainbow print that's very bright. Um, it has these horizontal stripes and it pairs so cute with this bag. I think the lining like makes the print. I think it's adorable. So again, this here is the sporty awesome mommy pocket here in the front, tons of internal organization. And I plan to do kind of an updated packing video for you guys, um, probably next week on this bag because I've been carrying it and I love it. And it's been a little while since I've shared the sporty and done kind of an in-depth review. So be on the lookout for that. That's going to be, like I said, coming probably next week. So that's the sporty. The next bag I want to share with you that a lot of people have been asking about is the Starlet. The Tokidoki prints look so cute on Starlets and Superstars and Super Bs. Those bigger bags, they're just adorable on like larger surfaces. But this here is the Starlet. It is the smallest of the two duffel size bags from Jujubee. It's awesome, awesome for travel. You have a zipper pocket here in the front. And then on the back of the bag, you have this long snap closure. And this particular part of the bag is lined with a bright red lining, which is so bright, it's so fun. And then the inside of this bag is lined with that really cute rainbow lining. So lots of fun in this particular bag. Like I said, it's the smallest of the two. This is the Starlet. It will be available in the Superstar, which is the same exact style bag, only it's just a little bit larger just to give you kind of a good idea. So that there is the Starlet. The next bag I'm gonna share with you is the Be Light. I love the Be Light. I carry it all the time um, for work. My kids love the Be Light if they're um, you know, out and about or if we're traveling or places like that. It is um, very similar to the Super B. So the Super B is gonna be a little bit wider. It's going to have three pockets in the front, whereas your Be Light is the smallest tote bag and it has these two pockets here in the front. So you have um, these pockets lined with that red lining like I just showed you in the Starlet. And then on the back of the Bee Light, you don't have any pockets. It's just a flat surface. But again, I love these kind of bright prints on these bigger bags because you can really get a good look as to what the print looks like. Tons of fun characters. My favorite always, as you guys probably know if you follow me, is Donatella right here, and she has the balloons, and it's so darling. Another one that I really love on this print is going to be um, Hello Kitty up here on the paper airplane. Like, that's adorable. I love it. I think it's so cute, but I also really like the characters on the rainbows kind of throughout the whole bag. I just, I love the print in general. I think it's really cute. So this here, like I said, is the, um, the Be Light bag. I also want to show you kind of the tag on this bag. Um, it's really cute. It kind of has the Tokidoki and Jujubee and Sanrio logo here with like the bow at the top. It's it's super cute. I like it. So like I said, that there is the Be Light bag. Another really, really cute one that I love in this print is the Mini Bee. The Mini Bee is one of those bags that I always seem to need in 
prints when they get newly released. My kids love mini bees. I have a three-year-old, well, almost four-year-old, a six-year-old, and a um, nine-year-old almost. All my kids have birthdays coming up in like the next 30 days, but, um, and they all wear mini bees really comfortably. Even my oldest, who is almost taller than I am, um, can still wear the mini bee comfortably, and my three-year-old wears it like awesome. He has one that he goes to school in, but, so this is the mini bee. I love it. It is so cute in this print and I was so excited to see my print placement of Donatella right here because she's not um, very, she's not in this print a lot. Like she's definitely obviously in there but I don't see her a lot throughout it. So it's kind of special when you get print placement with her on it in my opinion. So, but this is what the front of the mini bee looks like. How cute are those red zippers? And then of course you have this pop of the rainbow lining which is adorable on the mini bee i think it's so cute inside you do have one zipper in the mini bee but besides that zipper you don't have any internal organization it's just an open backpack with these um bottle pockets here on the side the back of the mini bee you do have this teal padded um lining back here so i know a lot of you were asking about that if it was black if it was teal what color it was so it is definitely teal and it has that cute kind of um hello kitty bow back there so it's adorable. I love how the straps look against the teal. I think that it was a great choice to have this color back here. So I want to give you one more look because I know a lot of you are very interested in the different types of print placements on these bags. So the mini bee is definitely a cute one in this print. Must have, must have, especially with these awesome red zippers. So that's the mini bee. Now I'm going to go ahead and get into the accessories and the like smaller bags. I have here the Bebop, which I know some of you that might be new to Jujubee may not be familiar with the Bebop. They released this little cute bag about two years ago or so when they did a Dreamworld collaboration, which was another one that they did with Tokidoki and Sanrio, and it was really, really cute. But um, this here is the Bebop. It's just a small little um, like circle clutch, if you will. My daughter loves these. Um, if you guys were following the last Tokidoki launch, they did the girl's best friend, which was very similar to this, only it was diamond shape. It's so cute on her. And if you guys have little itty bitties, you can definitely like tie up this strap so that they can wear this bag or it's long enough for you to wear crossbody. So it's just a cute little bag. I think it's really cute on this print. Um, you can also organ use this to organize your bigger bags inside, like your Super Bs or your B Lights. Put kids toys in it, put your things in it. On the inside, you do have this rainbow lining, and then you also have a zipper here at the top. So you could throw like your smaller chapstick and things like that, and then your keys and your phone inside here, and it's just like a cute little on-the-go clutch. So um, another great thing is it does come with this long strap, so those of you that maybe want a strap to go with your Be Quicks, you can take the strap off here and use that. Um, just kind of an idea there. So that's the Bebop. The other item that is a super popular organizational piece from Jujube is going to be the Be Quick. If I can get it off here for you guys, it's tangled up. <laughs> so this here is the Be Quick. I know there's been a lot of pictures of these kind of circulating so that you guys could get a really good taste of this print, but it is really cute. It's probably the best and the most popular organization piece from Jujube. It has this um, kind of detachable strap here on one side so that you can make it into a clutch. You can also attach here on these D-rings that long strap that I just showed you on the Bebop and wear this bag crossbody. The Quick is awesome for a million different things. You can put changes of clothes, you can put diapers, you can put toys, you can put the possibilities like are endless as far as the Jujube Be Quicks go. But this is what it looks like. It's really fun. Again, on this print, this print is really cute on all of the bags, but I really like this one. I love the print placement with um, everything here on the rainbow. Sorry, I can't see through the camera, but it's really cute. I love these little angels right over here. I think they're adorable. So I think the print placement on this quick is super cute. And then on the back here, it's very similar. I think that it's just a really adorable print. So that there is the quick, again, kind of Hello Kitty on the airplane over there. It's like great print placement. I love it. Really cute. So that's the Be Quick. Um, the next one I'm going to show you is the Fuel Cell, which is another like must have in this print. It's really, really cute. Um, the Fuel Cell is the insulated kind of lunch tote that Jujube has. Perfect for carrying bottles or snacks or lunches. My kids go to school with a Fuel Cell. 
every day and I wash them and all of these things are machine washable. I'm not sure if I mentioned it, um, but every single bag and piece here that you see is machine washable and the fuel cell is awesome to wash, especially if you're using it for like everyday lunch totes. So this is what it looks like. It's really cute. It's kind of like a U-shaped um, tote bag. You have a strap here at the top that can detach on one side. So you can attach this to a stroller or a bag or whatever, um, however you want to carry it. But that's the front. I have my little favorite right here. I was excited to see her on there. Um, and then lots of rainbows, which I love. So super cute on the back. I got Maz here on the rainbow. Oh, it's so cute. I love it. So the inside um, of the fuel cell is also rainbow lined, which is so cute. I just love, it's just like a happy print. You open it up and then you see that bright colored lining and it's really, really fun. So that's the fuel cell. The last pieces that I'm going to share with you are the two different organizational sets from Jujube. So you have the Be Organized, which is a three piece set that is made with a kind of mesh backing. And then you have the B set, which is another three piece set that are small um, zipper bags and they come with a long strap so that you can wear the bags crossbody or a short strap that you can use to wear them like wristlet style. So a lot of different ways that you can use them. This here is the large piece as far as the three piece B set goes. I'll show you those first and then I'll show you that B organized piece. So like I said, you have a large piece, a medium piece and a small piece. This is what the large piece looks like. They all have the rainbow lining, which is adorable. And then they all have D rings on the side so that you can wear it, like I said, with those longer straps. <clears throat> but this is the front of my large set piece. Very, very cute in this print. I love it. You can fit so much in these pieces. I will put below my playlist for Jujube, which has um, an in-depth review on the medium piece and the small piece. I don't know if I've done the large piece yet. I still need to do that one. Um, but it'll give you like 10 plus ways that you can use these bags and a couple of different ideas of things that you can store in them. They are the best way to organize any of your Jujube bags, any of your diaper bags, any of your handbags, travel bags. They really are the best way to kind of um, organize everything. So that right there is the large piece. The second piece um, is the medium set piece. And I actually have my medium and my small all packed up. I've been using it in my sporty. So inside here, I actually have a ton of toys for my youngest. I put some pictures on Instagram um, of him playing with them over the weekend when we were out to eat. But inside here, I just have a ton of little handheld toys. There's like Paw Patrol and PJ Masks and all of those that he loves. Um, but this here is what my medium piece looks like. It's again, adorable. I love Ma's like right there with the umbrella. Like how cute is that? I love it. Um, and then on the back here, I'll give you a look at what that looks like really, really adorable. So again, this is the medium piece. I have toys in there. Give you guys a good idea of um, how big this one is. And then the last piece in the three piece set is the small set piece, which is probably my favorite most used piece. I think it's just adorable. And there's so many different things that you can use this for. Um, but this here is what it looks like. Um, it is has the red zippers, of course, which I don't know. I'm not sure if I pointed those out, but that's what my small piece kind of down the hill peeking right there. But it has the Jujube tag here on the side. Inside this small piece, I actually have those twistable crayons. Um, they fit perfect in here. And I had a bunch of coloring books in the Beast Sporty in that back pocket. And so in here, I kept all of our like twistable crayons and they are the perfect fit inside small set pieces. It was just like match made in heaven. And there's a ton in here. There's probably like, I don't know, 20 different colors, 15 at least. Um, and like I said, they fit really good. So I know we use the twistable um, color pencils a lot, but the crayons are a really good size for inside these small set pieces. So the last piece that I want to share with you is going to be the Be Organized. And I'll kind of go um, quickly through these so that you can see the print comparisons um, that I want to show you at the end. But you have three different pieces just like the B set. You have this larger one, um, but they are all kind of lined with the print here on the side. Um, and then it has black mesh backing. That was a question that I was getting a lot from you guys is what color was this mesh? It is black. Um, the Be Organized are awesome because they are really um, like foldable inside your bags. You can store them easily. They're very lightweight. Um, it's just a different way that you can organize. This Nibby set um, is just really awesome way. So you have the large piece here and then you also have the medium piece, which is not quite as um, wide, but it is taller. So it's perfect for snacks. 
I love my print placement on this piece because of course I have my favorite Donatella right here. I have a rainbow kind of front and center, which is adorable. And then on the very, very back of the medium piece, I have her again and another um, like Stelina the unicorn here and another rainbow. So cute. I love it. So again, this here is that medium piece. And then you have the smaller piece that also has a cute little um, jujube tag on one side and then a Hello Kitty tag on the other. So it's really cute. These small pieces are really awesome for toys and um, like mini med kits. You can use them for so many different things. So that's the Be Organized. Um, that is everything that I have to share with you as far as the bag goes. A couple of different styles give you guys a really good feel as to what this print looks like on these bags. I'm going to go ahead and show you kind of an up close of them and then I want to show you just about four or five of my favorite print comparisons with this bag because I think they're really cute. There are so many really cute GGB prints that pair so well with this Rainbow Dreams. My favorite favorites have to be Rad and Happy Hearts. They are so cute with this particular print. I showed um, a picture over kind of on the chat pages and on my Instagram showing how well these look together. I love the different color teal hearts in rad hearts because you have kind of that cobalt and then you also have this teal which ties into the blue in the characters and the teal background it's like a match made in heaven especially the gray too because there's a lot of gray throughout rainbow dreams that i didn't necessarily notice at first and the rad hearts really pulls that out i think it's so cute i also really love happy hearts because there's of course a ton of pink throughout this print there's actually a little bit of this maroon throughout the bag and then this lighter gray um, also of course pairs in with all the gray accents so i think they're both really fun prints they look good um print wise up against each other so Good choice there. Another one that I really like is all of the black and white prints. Duchess looks so cute with this one, probably because there's a lot of white throughout the bag and then everything of course has is lined in black. So anything black and white I think looks really, really good. So that's Duchess. Also another favorite of mine is Black Magic. I think that looks awesome against this Rainbow Dreams. I had a question. Let me grab my um, change pad here on what black magic looks against the rainbow lining. If it was too busy or too much. And I really don't think so because the lines in the black magic are a little bit wider than this rainbow dreams. So I feel like you can really use this piece to organize the inside of your bags and it's just, it's not going to be too much. I think it looks really good up against it there. So that's black magic. And then of course, first lady will look awesome because they're just even wider um, black and white straps or stripes. Another one that I also really like, which is kind of an odd, is East Hampton. I mean, not like my favorite, or not East Hampton, um, Key West, but East Hampton, actually, I don't, I think I have that one down here. Um, no, I don't, but that one actually doesn't look that bad either. Um, you can see, again, I think it's like the gray that ties into it. It looks really cute up against it. So those of you that might have a couple of these left over from summer can definitely pair that with Rainbow Dreams. It's kind of cute. And then I also just pulled down one Tokidoki. This is the latest Toki Pops. You can pair any Tokidokis together. <laughs> like, I think that they all are fun and bright and um, they all look good together. But that's Toki Pops there. And then, of course, you have Blackout, which is going to go perfectly with this bag. So if you guys have a B set in Blackout or if you have one of these new um, mini fuel cells, looks so cute, especially inside the um, mini bees. It's adorable. So anyways, that's Blackout there. Um, but those are all of the pieces that I brought down to share with you. Um, as far as my favorites on this print goes, I like to kind of always um, share my favorites with each release. And definitely, like I said, Rad and Happy Hearts are like the ones that stole the show for me as far as pairings with this particular print. So I hope you guys found this review helpful. If you have any questions or comments on Rainbow Dreams or anything Jujube, please leave them in the comments below. Um, again, this print is releasing on December the 5th, and I will have all of the shopping links for everything Jujubee um, down in the description box. I appreciate you guys watching, and I'll talk to you very soon. Bye.